LCM lowest common multiple up to exercise 2 I was already provided you so today I'm going to start exercise 3 due to some reason I'm late so do not worry I'm uh, back again so I will do one by one each and every exercises so you can see here the question find the SCF and LCM actually we have to find out LCM only but I will show you how to find out SCF and LCM both so what is the first expression here 4x cube and second expression is 6x power 5 so let's take here first expression we have 4x power 3 first of all we have to reduce this 4 we have to find out the factors and the factor of 4 means 2 into 2 x power 3 we have to reduce it similarly 6 x power 5 and the second expression is here we have 6 x power 5 again this also reduce we can get here 2 into 3 2 3 is a 6 x power 5 now we have to find out lcm but we have to find out both scf and lcm i will show you how to find out scf and lcm both scf means common you can see here here is 2 and here is 2 so we can take here 2 common okay here is x power 3 here is x power 5 so which one is the smallest x power 3 so we have to write here x power 3 this one is scf similarly to find out lcm what we have to do we have to take common so first of all we have to take common and what is remaining here is 2 and here is 3 so we can take 2 common and 3 also common is 2 and remaining 2 and 3 2 and 2 common so 2 write down remaining 2 is here write on 2 remaining 3 is here write on 3 now in variable how to do here is x power 3 here is x power 5 which one is greatest x power 5 so we have to write here x power 5 in scf we have to take a smallest one but in lcm we have to take greatest one now 2 2 is a 4 4 3 is a 12 so 12 x power 5 is the answer is the lcm so hope you understand this how to find out scf and how to find out lcm look at this one number b here what is the first expression you can see here the first expression is x power 4 y power 3 if question in the form of variable no need to do no need to break it i will show you how to find out directly so leave it like this in second expression what is here 2x power 3 y power 4 i will show you how to find out scf and lcm both very simple way scf no scf means common here is 2 but here is no number so we cannot take now here is x power 3 here is x power 4 so in this 2 which one is the smallest x power 3 is the smallest so x power 3 we have to write down similarly y power 3 y power 4 which one is smallest y power 3 power we have to look at 3 so y power 3 so scf is equal to x power 3 y power 3 similarly to find out lcm now you can see here to find out lcm what we have to do here is 2 but here is no number in lcm what we have to do first of all we have to take common and then remaining but here nothing number common so we can take 2 here so 2 we can write now x power 3 x power 4 which one is highest power x power 4 so we have to take highest power x power 4 similarly y power 4 and here is y power 3 highest power is y power 4 so y power 4 in scf what we have to do lowest power we have to take but in lcm what we have to take we have to take highest power now you can see here x power 3 x power 4 this x power 3 we have to take in scf okay lowest power but finding lcm we have to take highest power x power 4 hope you understand this both question number one one a and one b now look at the question number c <coughs> here first expression what is here hope you can understand here properly if you are watching my videos if you understand please hit the like button and share with your friends here first expression is 8 a b first of all we have to break this 8 8 means 2 into 2 into 2 2 2 is a 4 4 2 is a 8 a b we have to convert into lowest form 2 into 2 into 2 similarly in second expression what is here 16 16 a square b square if um, if a small number then we can break but if big number 16 32 like this then how to do how to break it now look at here i will show you how to break it we have to do like this 16 2 8 the 16 2 4 the 8 2 2 the 4 uh, then what we have to write here 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 okay here is a square b square if variable no need to break variable we have to write down same similarly now we have to find out scf and lcm both how to find out scf here look at properly to find out scf we have to take common this is common so right here 2 similarly again 2 and 2 common right 2 
again 2 and 2 common write 2 this one is common the remaining is 2 no need to write down here is a a square which one is the smallest here a so we have to write down a b and b square which one is smallest b so we have to write down b and when you multiply what we get here 2 into 2 into 2 2 to the 4 4 to the 8 so we can write 8 a b similarly to find out lcm what we have to do to find out lcm first of all we have to take common 2 2 2 and again 2 so if we have to take common and what is remaining here if this one is another 2 is remaining so we have to write 2 now in variable what we have to do look at properly here is a here is a square so highest power largest power we have to take a square similarly b and b square which one is highest power b square so we have to take highest power one b square now let's multiply 2 to the 4 4 to the 8 to the 16 so 16 a square b square is the lcm hope you understand this question number c now look at this question number d here we have a negative also and three terms also first expression in first expression what is here minus 3 x square y z 3 means 3 into 1 so leave it no need to break this one and here is negative don't forgot this one second expression second expression here is 6 x y square z 6 means we can break it in the place of 6 we can write 2 into 3 2 3 is a 6 it is x y square z similarly in third expression what we can write here 12 x square y square z square so we can write here 12 x square y square z square in the place of 12 we have to break it uh, 2 2 is a 4 and 4 3 is a 12 and variable we have to write down same now we have to write find out scf actually we have to find out lcm only but uh, we, we i will show you how to find out scf and lcm both so it will be easy uh, for you to understand properly now how to find out scf and lcm both here scf means common is there anything common you can see here here is three here is three and here is three you can see here here is three here is three and here is three so we can write here three is the common now variable look at here here is x square here is x and here is x square lowest one lowest power we have to take x similarly for y y is here y square is here y square so lowest y one is y so we have to write on y similarly z z and z square lowest power z so scf is equal to 3 x y z now we have to find out lcm to find out lcm we have to take you can see here first of all common we have to take so we can take here common three if negative is here let's take negative also we have to take negative also after that now after taking three common in all three expression first second third now we have to check either common in first and second or second or third or first or third you can see here second in second and third there is a common two so this two and two we can take common so we have to write two and another two also remaining so here two so we have to write down two now largest power we have to take here is x square here is x here is x square so highest power is x square we have to write down similarly y y square y square highest power we have to take y square again z z square z square highest power we have to take z square so what we can write here uh, 3 to the 6 6 to the 12 so we can write minus 12 x square y square z square hope you understand this uh, up to d now look at the question number e and f in the same video <coughs> now look at the question number e uh, question is 20 x power 5 50 x y square and here 100 x cube y cube so here first expression what is there in first expression 20 x power 5 in the first of all we have to break it 20 means what we can write 2 to the 4 and 4 5 the 20 x power 5 similarly in second expression what we can write here 50 x y square so what we can write in the place of 50 um, if you don't know how to break then you can use rough and you can do it 50 2 25 the 50 and 5 5 the 25 so we can write 2 into 5 into 5 so here 2 into 5 into 5 x y square similarly in third expression what we can write here in third expression 100 is here 100 x cube y cube so in the place of 100 what we can write here let's uh, uh, do in rough 100 2 into 5 into 5 5 5 is a 
25s are 10, 0. Again, 225s are 5, 5s are. It means 2 into 2 into 5 into 5. So we can write here 2 into 2 into 5 into 5 x cube y cube after this we have to find out scf and then we i will show you how to find out lcm2 to find out scf we have to take common here 2 2 and 2 so we can take 2 common similarly you can see here is 5 5 and 5 we can take 5 also common any other uh, elements which is common in all three terms we i think we we don't have here you can see 2 is remaining, here 5 is remaining, but here 2 and 5 remaining. So nothing common. Now we have to take lowest variable. Now you can see in the question also, here is x power 5, here is x, here is x cube. So x is the smallest, so we have to take x. Similarly, um, y we, can, we cannot take. Here is y cube, here is y square, but y is not here, so y we cannot take. So what is the answer here? 10 x. Now let's find out LCM. First we have to take common. This circle one we can take. 2 into 5 okay now what is remaining you can see here 2 here and here so if common in first and second or second or third or first or third then you have to take common I just now I circle 2 and 2 so we have to write here 2 similarly common you can see here is 5 here is 5 so we have to write 5 don't write 5 into 5 don't write double time if common in two expression also we have to write only one time okay now here is x power 5 here is x and here is x power 3 so highest power we have to take x power 5 similarly y is not here y variable y is not here here is y square and here is y cube so y cube is greater so we have to write y cube now let's multiply 2 5s are 10 and 5 2s are 10 10 into 10 100 100 x power 5 y power 3 is the answer hope you understand this question now last one question number f is remaining uh, let's see question number F and after that uh, we will do question number 3 and 4 in next video Okay, so uh, look at here question number F a b c and next one is 4 a b square 6 a square b so here what is the first expression first expression is a b c no need to break leave it up to here in second expression uh, 4 a b square so 4 means we can write 2 into 2 2 to the 4 a b square similarly in third expression 6 a square b in the place of 6 what we can add when you break this we can write 2 into 3 2 3 is a 6 a square b now we have to find out scf and lcm both i will show you how to find out scf and lcm both here okay scf means common you can see here here is 2 here is 2 but here is no number so we cannot take any number common here is a okay in first expression a in second expression a and in third expression a square lowest one we have to take lowest means a lowest power we have to take okay now here is b here is b square and here is b so we can write here b only here is c but here is not c and here also not c so we cannot take c common so scf is equal to ab to find out lcm now look at here in lcm what we have to do we have to take common but in number no common you can see in second and third expression we can take common here is two here is two so we can write two now i think nothing common so remaining we can take here is two here is three so we can write two into three after this a a a square highest power we have to take a square similarly b b square b so b square we have to take here is c here is not c here also not c so c we have to take c so what is what happened here 2 to the 4 4 3 is a 12 12 a square b square c is the answer hope you understand today's uh, video related with um, lcm and scf i done from um, 1a to 1f from exercise 3 we have to find out lcm but i shown how to find out scf and lcm both in my second live i will do question number two hope today only after few minutes i will come live for question number two if you understand please hit the like button if you are new on my channel please subscribe and hit the bell button so you will get the notification of upcoming videos too thanks for watching till last and within five ten minutes i will be back for question number two uh, if you are free you can join and learn this lcm thanks for watching till last have a great day